In this video, you're gonna learn how to make over 125 thousand stubs or more some free packs and a couple of free diamonds and a bunch of golds and silvers and bronze before we begin though make sure you leave a like subscribe on the channel we're still pushing for 50,000 subscribers this year we're very close to 40,000 subscribers on the channel and this is gonna be pretty good for you guys so just playing the game you're gonna make over 100,000 stubs a bunch of packs and some cards that you might need for the future depending on how you want to play this out but let's hop into what we're gonna be talking about today so we're gonna head over into online modes now a lot of you might already know this but we're gonna have a lot of players out there that are new to the game and don't even know that this can be done or you know haven't realized that you can make this much stubs just by playing this game mode so online modes we're actually going to be talking about the battle royale program so lots of stubs to be made in this program here and i'll show you how and why it's gonna make you a lot of stubs um but just jumping into like the br program choice packs right now so as you can see here it's actually you're gonna actually get a little bit more so i didn't realize this was 2x choice pack so br program choice packs the first one is the bronze so as you progress through this battery up program as you see underneath like each each uh things that you can unlock it says 5 br to unlock 500 stubs 10 br to unlock the the two br program bronze choice packs i'll show you how to get those those points easier and a little bit faster all right so but jumping into the choice pack real quick here you might notice when you go into one of these players you go into the locations and it'll tell you how much they're selling for so this specifically right here trevor hoffman 2500 stubs now you're most likely going to want to keep these cards here in the future so that way you can lock them in for collections for better cards later in the season but if you're just here specifically to make stubs to open packs and make more stubs that way we're, we're going to be talking about possibly selling these guys for more stubs so right now this bronze right here is going for 2500 stubs and i'm honestly shocked at how much they're going for right now so 2500 stubs for two of them so that's 5k just for this pack alone plus you get 2500 xp plus the 500 subs right there so keep that in mind so that's 5k alone right there as you progress through you're gonna get some free packs here so this one's a pack and more xp and then we're i'm gonna show you real quick the silvers the silvers are going for about 5,000 stubs each so you're only gonna get one here though but once you progress to the gold ones the gold ones are going for about 8,000 500 stubs per choice pack so just to this first gold one alone you're going to be making about 25,000 stubs and it should be pretty easy to get to that 30 range right there so but you're gonna get a total of four bronze choice packs four silver br program choice packs and four of the gold ones as well as you progress through so along the way you're gonna get those free packs and then all the way up to 100 until you get the diamond br choice pack that holds a diamond that's around 45,000 stubs so if you end up selling them that's 45k right there so and then there's a 90 overall larry doby as well that's going for about 12,000 stubs but if you're going to keep these diamonds that's cool too and then 10 pack bundle they did add a little bit more here so more free packs more stubs at the end so a total five ballins at the end that's more free packs there to open up for possibly more diamonds more stubs for you guys so that's why i said about 125k or more just on this program alone so that i mean once this program's done there's gonna be a new program so we'll have to see how much we can make but i'm gonna assume that prices for the new cards because we're gonna get new cards every single time in these choice packs every single one so battle royale 2 will get a new set of guys that will probably be as expensive so but so how do we finish the br program easier without really having to win a lot of games you don't have to win a lot of games you don't have to go 12 and 1 you don't have to go 12 and 0 to be able to finish this up so it's all about the draft ladies and gentlemen so as you see here if we go into the bronze the silver and the gold br exclusives hop into the bronze real quick you're gonna see 
you're gonna need to get parallel XP. That's just by playing the game. So you're just by playing the Battle Royale games, you're gonna wanna draft all these players here and finish up that PXP. And it doesn't require much to get, you know, their parallel XP up to get those four reward points. So just the bronze alone, we've got four, eight, 12, 16. 16 PXP that's gonna give you just by finishing the bronze players alone. So draft these guys are here. Bronze, Veteran Fox, Veteran Feller, Rookie Hoffman, and Rookie Bogarts. And these cards are actually the cards that are available. So if you need to see which the cards you need to draft, they're right here. So this will be updated, like I said, once Battle Royale 2 comes out for the program. And then these will change as well. And then those are going to be the guys that you need to, to draft. That, that same thing with the Silvers. The Silvers will have Rookie Real Muto, Guerrero Jr., Breakout Castellanos, All-Star Melanson. And if you go into the BR program Silver, these are the cards that you need to draft and get the Parallel XP for. Then we've got the Gold BR exclusives. That's Veteran Renfro, Breakout Richard, All-Star Wood, Veteran Gehrig. And if you need to know what those cards are, head over into the Gold BR program. And there you go. There you have it. So finishing up every single player will actually net you 48 total BR points. So that's going to unlock you um, at least two of the gold BR programs. So I would say you'll make about 40, 50,000 stubs just by finishing up the players. So how do we get the rest of them? How do we get the rest of the, the BR points to get all the way up to 100? Well, there are BR missions. So we've got the repeatal win one BR game. Every BR game you win, you get one BR point. So whether it's one game, you're going to get one. 12 games, you're going to get 12. If you are good enough to go 12-0, that's going to give you a big boost. That's going to give you a total of 20 BR points right there. You can't see it above my camera, but 20 BR points. This one's also repeatable here. Nine plus games will net you 10. So 10 plus the nine that from your win. So 19 total every single time when you win nine games now there's also a base uh, missions here that will net you a total of 10 20 40 40 more right there so 4,000 in a single br entry so a single br entry is before you lose twice so in br when you lose twice you gotta restart you gotta start over so that's pxp that's gonna take it from every single one of your players and this should go pretty quickly here 40 hits, so you have to get 40 total hits in a single BR entry before you lose two. That might be a little bit harder. 15,000 PXP, so you got to progress a little bit further into the games before losing your two games and restarting over. That's 15k. That gives you 15. So, and then 20 home runs. This might be a little bit harder here too to hit 20 home runs in all your BR games, but it's all an all star, so home runs should come and go. But that's it, man. That's that's gonna give you a lot of stubs, ladies and gentlemen. My, my suggestion though is if you don't care about stubs, try to keep these players. Like I said, you're going to need these for collections later down the line for better diamonds and you don't wanna be playing catch up. In previous years, they did allow us to try and get these cards again, but who knows if they're gonna do that this year. And if they don't, if they don't try to give us ways to grab these packs again, these cards might just keep shooting up in price. So, but there you go. There you have it. 8,400 for the golds. That's a lot. You're going to get four total. So just the golds will give you 40K. And let's be real here. You're watching this video because you want to open packs. So get those open, get those packs, get the stubs to buy the packs. And we're all degens, right? Right? So you're watching this video because you want those packs and those stubs. But thank you all so much for watching today. I hope this helps. Those of you that are new to the game, probably the only video we'll make about the Battle Royale program because it's going to be basically the same once Battle Royale 2 comes out. But we'll see what they give us for rewards in Battle Royale 2 program, which is going to be in two days. So, but thank you all so much for watching today. I hope you enjoyed. I hope this helps. Leave a like, leave a sub, and as always, I'll catch you in the next one.